They're not of the earth. You know? That, so that lets you know off top. Uh, Jeremiah 10 and 2. Thus says the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them. The reason I read that was we're supposed to see that and understand that that's our Savior coming back, a sign of our Savior coming to get us. That's right. For those that understand and believe. Now, now the other nations, they're going to be like, oh, wow, oh, and all you two thirds going to be like that. And all y'all pushing that false doctrine going to think like that. Yep. You know? But but when you when you when we see it, we're like, oh yeah, tighten up, I can't let's you know. Yep. It just strengthens our faith and our belief even more. That's right. That's right. Um, back in uh, second Andrew nine and seven. You want know, something else? Uh, 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 Twenty one. Yeah. Uh, I Nation against nation, kingdom against kingdom. That's why you have the whole conflict uh, with the Middle East, you know? And why is the Lord even doing that? It's because the prophecy of uh, Armageddon has to happen, where the Lord's gonna bring all the armies of the nations and bring them into that concentrated area within the, in, in the Middle East, in, par in particular uh, Saudi Arabia, which that's where the war is gonna be fought, you know? It's gonna be it's gonna be the the the, the, air, the concentrated area where all these nations are gonna be fighting, and then it's gonna end with a nuclear bang, and then right in the midst of that, the heavenly the heavenly Father is gonna send His Son, Yahweh Shai, with the with the uh, the chariots and the angels, and they're gonna come and beam up the elect and shoot lasers upon you people, and, and, and start tearing you uh you you military all the military they gonna get clapped down, you know. That's what's gonna happen, man. But the buildup to that is nation rising up against nation. Yep. Well, if they're rising, if nations are rising up against nations, how are they gonna come together for that embargo or that Christianity? Uh -huh. Like this stuff ain't that enough. Yep. You know, I'm talking about that, that other doctrine that y'all push out. That yep. shit does not add up. Yep. Yep. Uh, and you got Russia, they they having drills every week, man. They're getting ready. They're getting their ammunition ready, they're getting their missiles tested. Yep. You know, they having joint drills. People moving ships in a certain area. Yeah, you man. Know about to go down. They moving troops to, uh, to, to to certain borders in hopes of Mer uh, uh, America overstepping the border. Yep. They doing all those things, man, because they getting ready. They know the uh, war is coming. They putting their chess pieces in order. Right up, man. And then Iran is about to get back into the forefront. You know? Because they're looking for any excuse to go into Iran. That's why they're surrounded 
That's why all the countries that America is in conflict with is surrounding the Gulf of uh, uh, um, what's that? the Persian Gulf, man. Because they're trying to get uh, 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 at the the end game is to get uh, uh, Iran. That's like the you are right and there. you already yeah. in conflict with with Russia, and and, and uh, Iran is the uh, the ally of uh, Russia, man. Uh, and who's gonna be responsible for for uh, for that? Israel, them gutter rats over there, because they ain't control of of it all any damn way. They ain't control of that whole uh, Gaza Palestine conflict, you know, the wars, you know, and they're trying to have it. They trying to have it uh, to the point that. Um, it's, it's about Islam versus uh, Judaism, you know? Right. ISIS and, and the whole Islamic uh, 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 structure. Uh, uh, jihad. Jihad, you know? They, they, they're, they're placing the, the blame on them and making it seem like it's a war between them and, 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 and them uh, in, in the Middle East. But really, the whole conflict is just about uh, uh, the elites playing a chess, a chess piece, man, because they ain't control of it all. You know, but the Heavenly Father is the one that got them in the trick bag. Yep. The Lord is making is, is, is making them control how, how the war is going to go because everything is in the Heavenly Father's hands. Right. All right. They're not going to offset prophecy yep. at all. They're not going to offset prophecy. When you hear about uh, a nation talking about a peace treaty or speaking peace, it's really not going to be peace. You know. They're, it's just for the moment, all right? But the moment that same nation that, for, for instance, if America has a conflict with a nation and then all of a sudden they want to make peace, eventually that nation is going to do something to where America is going to hop back in their face and try to regulate. All they got to do is be like, all right, we no longer want to deal with the American currency. We don't want to use that as a way of, uh, uh, as a means of trade we ain't gonna use your currency right. as a mean of trade. Well, so therefore, no. so so therefore, now America takes that as a as a threat. Yep. Now that's an act of war. Now we enemies again. Yep. That's that's what's been happening. All right. That's just a sign, man. That's just that's just one of the signs that the Lord spoke of. Right. Go ahead, huh? Verse eleven. Matthew 21 11. And great earthquakes shall be in diverse places, and uh -huh. famines, and pestilences, and fearful sights, and great signs shall be there from the heaven. Yep. So you're going to see great signs from the heaven. All these things are going to be taking place simultaneously. All right? Because that's what the Lord said, man. You're going to see all these different things. But apparently, you people don't see it. That, you're, you're asleep. All you, all you Negroes and, and, and Spix is worried about right now is the Mayweather, upcoming Mayweather fight, man. Mayweather fight, yeah, yeah. You know? You yeah, niggas, all you... This town flooded with just random yep. ass tourists coming for that fight already. Yep. Friday, yep. right, they ain't even made yet. Y'all already uh, lining up from these casinos. Yep. Yeah, I mean, over there, they're over there. Yep. Y'all just slapped it, bro. Uh -huh. Y'all wrapped up a bunch of folly and bullshit. Nobody, what's gonna, what's the big deal about this fight? Because it's gonna be a good fight? Okay, so after the fight, then what? The missiles still gonna come and destroy America. The martial law troops are still gonna be uh, lining up in these streets before that. The famine is still coming. People still gonna be eating their babies. Earthquakes and uproars are still gonna be happening. World War III is still gonna pop off. Whether, whether Mayweather or Pacquiao wins. That shit has, you guys act like that's the most important thing on the earth today. Yep. When there's way bigger issues going on. That's not even an issue. That's just another form of entertainment for you to give up your damn money. Yeah, you niggas, you, 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 a lot of you niggas, man, y'all out of touch, man, with reality. Instead of preparing for what this devil's getting ready to do to you, you finna prepare for uh, the fight parties, man. Yep. You finna try to get all your drink, all the food that you got, that you prepping for all the all the uh, pork ribs and all that shit, man. You're not gearing up for what's about to happen. You 
niggas going to stay asleep. And I won't be su surprised that this devil, uh, uh, Barack Obama, signs something into oh, legislation yeah. on oh, fight, yeah, on yeah, fight yeah, night, man. She would fall for it. Yeah. That would be the perfect. That would be the perfect. Miles. Yeah, that would be the perfect night uh. for them to sign sign whatever bill that they're gonna sign, just just so they can get you niggas later, man. Yep. Yeah. Let's go. I, that, it, it worked like clockwork, man. Yeah, he been doing that already. You yeah. know, it's always a major event where the masses is distracted. Yeah. Where they start signing shit, man. When the whole when the public is distracted. Whatever upcoming entertaining uh, event yeah. takes place, National that's holidays. the best. That's the best time for these devils to get together and do what they're gonna do yeah. against you. And, and, it, and it's these party distractions when you all liquored up that really yeah. get you. When you're but, not paying attention. Hey man, to this you. this I'm gonna fuck about this fight coming up, man. We are, we already Don't get me wrong. we we'll like eventually to see it. it. We'll eventually see it. Yeah. But. That's not what, you know what I'm saying? We ain't finna place our our, uh, our whole mind oh, and, and our whole psyche yeah, yeah. on this event, man. Because at the end of the day, it's just bread and circuses, man. Right. That's what they want to distract us with. We already know Mayweather been sold out, man. That's why he got those, that's why he has this deal. Ever since the nigga got out of jail, he been getting them deals, man. Before Mayweather, what fighters was making those type of making that type of money each fight. Right. Them other fighters wasn't, they didn't have it like that, man. Now you have Mike Tyson who was making a killing and he I got rich. Level, you know what I'm saying? Huh. But what eventually happened to that nigga? I took it back. I took it. I took his money. He didn't want to cooperate no more. Or he lost. I took his money. And they saying the tickets for this upcoming fight is, is becoming uh, uh, on a, a, a Super Bowl level of, of money, man. Eleven thousand dollar tickets. Yep. Hey, the pay per view went up from like sixty to like ninety. That shit is like a hundred dollars. Yeah, like ninety nine dollars. Gonna get worse closer to the fight party. Uh, you know, but that's these devils, man. That's, that, that's how they get their money, man. Cause you know he, uh, 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 Pacquiao and. Um, uh, 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 Mayweather, they, they, they made that deal with the devil, man. Cause, uh, 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 Mayweather is with, with Showtime, and, oh, yeah. and, and Pacquiao is with HBO. I watched that, that whole shit, that them devils that run those, uh, 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 those networks, they're billionaires. You know? So they're the ones that are responsible for, uh, 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 basically putting out these, uh, uh, the hype. They put together these little shows called like uh, All Access and uh, 24, 7. 24 7 Inside, you know what I'm saying? The life of, they, they, they push that shit so you can become uh, uh, moved, you know what I'm saying? On these particular uh, 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 entertainers so you can get ready for their upcoming event. And you niggas are gonna start, you gonna spend all that money. Yeah. A lot of niggas gonna be making bets. Yeah. Niggas gonna be getting, hey man, niggas gonna go broke. It's gonna be so much nigga activity going on, man. A lot of niggas gonna be getting killed because <laughs> yeah. the shit like that. Niggas getting murked because they didn't pay up on the bet. They don't. They didn't want to pay up. You know, I have, I had, I had this amount of stacks on Money May. You had these, this amount of stacks on on Pacquiao. Mayweather whipped his ass, and now you can't pay me, so I gotta kill you now. You know. Simple shit like that, man. Yeah. Meanwhile, this devil, he finna, he, he finna get ready to put, sign something on paper that's finna uh, get you niggas more and more ready for the new world order and, and martial law. You niggas gonna get what's coming to you, man. And we ain't gonna shed no tear, man. We gonna laugh at you. You know? I'm not looking forward to, no, uh, to the fight, man. I'll watch it. You know what I'm saying? If it's there, but I I'm not finna order that shit. And it's funny because here in Vegas, where the fight is actually at, it's harder to get to watch the fight. Yep. It's harder to watch the fight. You gotta pay to see the fight in this town. Because yep. you wanna be in that energy of the moment and 